Hello everyone. I'm about to make Cassio with Peppy for the first time. Here is a photo. I'm ready to go. Let's do this. First step is to boil some water. Once it's boiling, add your pasta. I'm aware this is usually made with spaghetti or bucatini pasta. I for some reason grab linguine. Time to let this cook. I forgot to mention this. Make sure you salt your pasta water. According to the recipe I followed, melt tablespoons of butter in a pan. Just a heads up, my camera work is all over the place. It's hard doing this one-handed. I realize this isn't a lot of black pepper. I messed up measuring, so I had to grind up more peppercorns off camera. Hard in my poor swirling movements. Next is to add one half cup pasta water to the pan and let it simmer. I honestly don't know what I'm doing. I hope I don't screw this up. My butter got a little browner than expected, but that's okay. Once your pasta is cooked, add it to the pan and add your cheese. Casio e Pepe translates to cheese and pepper. Then, mix it vigorously. I did have to add more cheese and pasta water if needed. I'm really bad at doing this one-handed, holy moly. So far, it's not looking too bad. I think I'm ready to go. I tried plating it up all fancy, but that didn't happen. Next, I took a pic for my Instagram. Here is the photo. Let's give this a taste. Fingers crossed. I didn't screw up. Okay, guys, so I'm about to review my pasta. I am really hoping I didn't mess this up, but if I mess up, it's okay. It's my first time making this. Um, sorry if my voice sounds a little hoarse. Um, I volunteered at a hayride last night, and I was trying to rest my voice all day. Hence why the first half, I didn't talk at all. Overall, it tasted pretty good. Um, it definitely didn't have much of a cheese flavor. I definitely tasted the black pepper, but it wasn't, like, overwhelming. I will say, not bad for my first time making this. So that's always a good thing. I'm still eating it, so that's a good sign. Um, yep, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video.